here on Lights and Buttons. Back with the last episode, we have the 2015 Nissan Murano fitted with the 17-inch motor wheels and the Blizzak winter tires. Now that we confirmed that they physically fit onto the car, let's talk about the TPMS. Will the Nissan Murano automatically recognize the TPMS and pick them up? Or will it error out and we have to get us some kind of tool to pair these two up? The answer to that question is yes, the car will automatically recognize the TPMS sensors from the new wheels. In our last video, we talked about ordering the wheels and tires from TireRack.com. And when you add the package into the cart, it does say that the new TPMS sensors must be initialized at the dealer. Now, I don't know what this means. Does this mean that we need a special device to automatically pair up the TPMS sensor from the wheel to the car? Do we need to do anything special with the TPMS reset within the car using the, let's say, OBD2 port? Um, not sure, right? So I went off into the forums and I was kind of hoping that this would be like my other car, the 2013 Acura TL, where if you drive it enough, it will automatically register the new TPMS sensors to the car and then read from it without you needing to do anything manual. Um, in the forums, the answers were kind of all over the place. A lot of people were saying that manual resets are needed. Um, some people talked about buying like a 200 to $300 TPMS device to do the pairing. Um, others, uh, a smaller number did say that it will automatically work with the car. And I'm not sure if it's one of those things where it varies between models and uh, year of the cars. Um, I'm not really familiar with TPMS in general. I'm kind of new to this. The only other car I messed around with tire-wise was my, my Acura TL. So for me, with the TL, if it kind of worked like that, that would be great. Um, so I decided to give this a try, right? I also called up the Nissan dealership that's local to us and they quote unquote didn't have the answer. I'm not sure what was the case, but um, I asked them, hey, if you switch out the tires um, and you got different wheels on, will this automatically work? And they said that most of the customers use one set of tires and that's the you know OEM all season tires that comes with the car and they don't ever switch it out. So that I believe, but did they really not know if this can automatically uh, read the new TPMS sensors. I don't know. Um, I guess I could have made other calls, but I said, hey, let's just try it ourselves and see what the results are. When you first turn on the car, you get the usual, you have to drive the car a little bit before the TPMS system registers. And then after three miles of driving, I did see the new tire pressure readings. And just to confirm, as you can see, I did feel the tires a little bit on the high side. I bled out some of the air and did see the new tire pressure readings refresh after a little bit. So for me, at least in my case, it worked without an issue. This certainly was an interesting experiment. I was really unsure about the wheels since the owner's manual wasn't really clear about this. And also different people had different responses that were not consistent. Hopefully, if you're in the same situation, and I'm not sure if this applies to all third generation Nissan Muranos, and who knows, that might be the case, that this will also help you out. If you have more information on TPMS, like I said, I'm not an expert on TPMS, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next video.